Okay. One, two, three. Hello, folks. It is I, Napalm, and we're back with more Spider-Man. So we just completed the main story, um, well, yeah, on Ultimate Difficulty. Um, and I got my trophy that I beat it, you know, like, oh, you know what, that reminds me, actually. Oh, yeah, we're going to do the next video with this video with uh, Cyborg Spider-Man. This one actually, uh, actually it seems really cool. It reminds me of a uh, solid snake. Okay, so see, that's the difficulty that I've always been playing, even on New Game Plus. But I, it does make it easy. Yeah, and that's like the easiest. That, that, and yeah, that's like medium. But you know, like I said, New Game Plus makes it like freaking easy. So we're gonna put it on ultimate. I mean, with, I mean, like, with the New Game Plus carryover, it's gonna still, you know, my combat is better, but those guys could still do some serious damage to me. So in a way, kind of works out. Okay, let me double check. Okay, cool. All right, let's do the DLC. Let's do. The heist. It's this is actually one of my least favorite. Uh, part of the whole city that never sleeps saga. This one's my least favorite. Just because I, oh, I found cat annoying cat black black cat really annoying in this one. And Spider Man was made to look like a complete Mary Jane Watson, dumbass. associate editor. Begin research notes. My sources are saying the Magia is mounting a comeback. The old crime families were all but wiped out, until Fisk went away and they started filling the void. The old Dons were working oh, harmoniously way, for years, fan, but I'm now sorry. that there's a power vacuum, there's bound to be a power struggle. It's only a matter of time before one of the families makes a move on the others. Better follow up with my sources in the Force. Hopefully we can stop this crime comeback before it even starts. Yeah. Spidey is made to look like a complete dumbass by Felicia and her father, which we meet in the game later. Hey Pete, I'm working on a story you might be interested in. The Oscorp expose? New one. It's about the Magia crime families. The mom? I thought they went out with swing dancing. Both times. They were in decline, but with Fisk and the demons gone, La Cosa Nostra is making a comeback. I love it when you talk dirty. Easy tiger. So you know the feds raided the Magia last month? Sure. Well, one of the Dons had this lost masterpiece painting called the Maria, and now they're displaying it over at Manhattan Mocha. And? And I have a source who says one of the families is planning to steal it back tonight. Sounds like there's more to it than just art appreciation. I'll swing by the museum. MJ, looks like your source was right. There's a small army of goons trying to break in. Stay on the line while I take a closer look. Just be careful. If those guys are Magia, they play for keeps. Hurry up. Come on. The boss wants that painting. We should have been in and out by now. You want to try? Be my guest. Sheesh. Some people do anything to avoid paying full price admission. I actually have not read, like, this version of Spider-Man. Where he's a cyborg. I have read the one where, like, the mark, like, the one that everybody went apeshit over this one. But cyborg is one of them that I have not read, so. Okay, what are my power gonna be? Oh, God, it's, it's starting to come. The yawns. Okay, titanium, they could shoot me. Create, distort, the quad damage. Um, ooh. I don't know. Oh, that one. Yeah, we could do this one. Okay, now let me check. Perfect dodge, web attacks, increases damage. Uh, no, we want that. Okay. They give us any trouble, says kill on sight. Yeah, this actually reminds me of um the version of Spider-Man that I'm reading right now. Um, It's like, okay, I still don't know if it's like... Because J.J. Abrams, his name is on the cover of the, of the comic. But I don't know if he wrote it or he had some. I think These guys have to it. learn to appreciate art during business hours. Cause I don't know if he has a kid, and you know he's just like, I'm a kid. I want to make a, 
got it based on, you know, my son and like the similarities of our relationship. It's just like, it's actually cool. I don't think that's been done before. Like Spider-Man, like, I'll give you the gist of it. So Spider-Man, he's, Peter Parker's not Spider-Man anymore because a certain incident happened that forced him to give up the costume, you know, the red and blue costume. Um, and in the process, he loses his hand. Kind of like the guy that we were playing as right now. I mean, this guy had lost a whole arm, but in the comics, Peter lost his hand. Um, so he has a kid. And, you know, the kid, you know, is living a normal life. And then, you know, that one day, he's just like, I have spider powers. Oh, my God. And, yeah, that's where, you know, it's pretty much just Spider-Man 2.0, except with Peter's Peter and Mary Jane's kid. Or Gwen Stacy's kid. I don't know. One of them has a kid. I'm not, I'm not going to Read it yourself. You'll find out. I don't want to put too much spoilers in it. But the thing is, it's just like the whole, like, um, it, it's kind of like over like these past like year or two years ago like they're kind of starting to follow this formula like you know the father and son or the father and daughter kind of idea I feel like it's being starting to be used a lot like I'm not wow I'm not taking these guys out that quickly I'm just talking but I'm kind of making a point you know the whole like you know like the father figure and then this like you know the child figure, it's been done a little too much. I mean, the first game that, I mean, the first movie that comes to mind is Logan. And, you know, it's just like, Logan, you know, you have a, you have a daughter you didn't know about. What the hell is that? And, uh, and yeah. And, you know, he spends the movie, you know, just like, trying to, I don't know. I think Lord, 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 Lord. Sleep it off. Um, and yeah. Okay, I'm just trying to take these guys out. It's, I spent way too long time, so uh, hold on. Let me, I'll get back to that. I'll get back to that. Okay. Yeah. Pop. There we go. And we'll roll with this guy. But yeah, Logan and his I know daughter. Some of these guys. It was fresh. That's it was pretty Federico cool. Frizzelli and Sal Petrillo. And then, Those guys um, are part of Hammerhead's crime family, right? Why would he want the Maria? It doesn't seem like his thing. I'm gonna look around. Make sure no one got in a different way. I'll let you know if I find anything. Yeah, but there's more examples that I can't really think of. God of War. You know, like, uh, you know, like, Kratos and Atreus, like, loosely Front based on Port Better check the other entrances. And his son. So he's just like, I have a son. I should make a story about this. And then there's some other ones. These like, guys couldn't even park moment, legally. But, you know, I'll put them in the video. <laughs> Wait, what's this? Nope, no one got in through here. Hey, what is that? Oh god, no. MJ, someone cut a hole in a skylight. I'm gonna check it out. What's the next one? That's Yeah, I think the last one is just J.J. Abrams, you know, Peter Parker, and then his son, and then taking up the mantle of responsibility. And, I mean, nothing bad with it. It's just kind of, I think it's starting to get a little old, a little stale. So I think my advice to the director, the writer is, so while Hammerhead's go with that guys were trying quickly to break before, in the front, you know, someone else looked in through the room. Looks that way. No sign of anyone. At all. Shouldn't there be guards here at night? Yeah. Maybe check the security booth near the entrance. There should be cameras there too. They would have seen whoever broke in. The security booth's secure. Need a palm print to get in. Any clue about what happened to the guards will be inside. Is there a way to override the lock? Uh, not without a guard's hand. <laughs> Actually, their handprint. If you can't find the guards, maybe you can lift prints from the things they touched. Oh, yeah. Good idea. Always happy to lend a hand. Oh, crap. It's like two of Okay. If I were a handprint, where would I be? Wonder if there's a print on here. Got a handprint. Well, a part of one. Looks like I'll need more. Weird. It's like the guards just vanished. Now, where can I find some more partial prints? Coffee cup. Still warm. 
Another one. Cool. Trained guards wouldn't leave their stuff around like this. Unless they didn't leave voluntarily. I know there's a print on here. Just need to find it. That might work. And I think 12 down should be karaoke, not kumquat. Okay, I should have enough partials to reconstruct a handprint. I should be able to reconfigure the scanner so it takes my data. <clears throat> If I bypass the optic sensor, I can upload. Got it. Oh my Transmitting God. handprint oh, now. Magic. I just completely fixed that on my own. We're in. Nice. What do you see? They're alive. Looks like they were tranquilized. No signs of a struggle. Definitely not Hammerhead style. So if not Hammerhead, who? Is there a camera feed? Let me check. Someone switched off camera five. Well, that's suspicious. Let me turn it back on and see what they didn't want anyone looking at. It's pointing at one of the paintings in the exhibit. That has to be the Maria. And no one's stolen it yet. I need to see this up close, figure out what's so special about it. The Maria is a brilliant example of modern pastoral impressionism. The saga of its repeated theft and recovery are almost as intriguing as the artwork itself. Looks like a pretty normal painting to me. It is. There's way more valuable stuff in that museum. So why is the Magia so worked up about this painting? Hang on, MJ. Someone's coming. Keep an eye out. Spider-Man could still be here. Oh, damn it. Got a lock behind security glass. Hey, tell Frank we're gonna need to break out the big guns. Yeah, Rob was Spidey's active pretty cool. <laughs> Cyborg Spidey. MJ, Hammerhead's guys called in reinforcements. They haven't spotted me yet. Good. Try to keep it that way. Eyes open. Got the signal. That means he was here. Maybe he split, maybe he's still around. So eyes open. Somebody there? You literally didn't see that coming. Cops will be here any minute. The hell with this. Grab what you can and run. Great. Now they're looting the other art. Gotta stop them before they make it out. There's only next time try the gift shop. Oh, it's gonna be so hard to beat these guys, I just realized. Prize, I send you a poster of that piece for your prison cell. Oh god. Art classes in prison. Okay, maybe I should set up a trap. 
just in case. The boss sends his regards! That's not good! Okay, no, they ran into the traps anyways. God damn it. Almost there! We gotta get to the exit and cut him off. Got it. Okay, I don't see that. Leave him this good taste in art. Poor life choices. Here comes the pain. So bad. Peter, you there? You okay? Yeah, I think I got them all. A lot of art to put back, though. What about the Maria? This could have all been a distraction. My thoughts exactly. I'll head back there. Hopefully the glass was thick enough. Security walls intact and bulletproof. Nobody's getting near the Maria anytime me. soon. Mission or accomplished then. From, uh, I hope so. Yeah, I am gonna have to call you right back. Why? What's going on? You look good. <laughs> Been working out? No. Oh. I mean, you know, a little. So, you swinging solo now? Or back with your ex? That's a lot of questions. I'm just. Curious. Yeah, I hear that's bad for cats. How about you tell me why you're really here? I was just waiting for the right moment. Look behind you. Okay, now this is where I'm probably going to run into trouble. Rockets? Who brings rockets to a museum? Have you not met Hammerhead? Oh, that was Maroon. 
I like your new tricks. And I'm tired of your old ones. Weren't you gonna stop stealing art? Who said I'm here for the art? What are you doing? I think you have lives to save. Oh, not again. She go. Peter, is everything okay? Sorry, MJ. I just uh, ran into an old friend. Who? Trouble. Oh wow! And they even modeled the bandage in the practice or just the loading screen. That's really cool. Really good attention to detail. This game had a lot of that. Like with the homemade suit, like the little strands on the hoodies, they would like, they had really good physics, so that was really cool. So Black Cat was the one who went in through the roof? She was working with Hammerheads guys? Yeah, she was probably watching me the whole time I was in there. Just tell me you didn't let her get away with the Maria. She didn't. Good. She smashed it and stole a data drive hidden in the frame. What? Uh... Sorry. So what do you think was on that drive? Good question. I'll start asking around. And I guess I'll start following cat prints. Alright. Okay, well, this has been fun. Um, I could go on to the next mission. It's just like a little bomb run. But I'm not tired yet, but I at least want to get some sleep. I want to be good to myself. Anyways, this is where I'm going to stop, guys. Thank you guys again for watching. Leave a like, comment, and if you're new to the channel, subscribe to keep up to date. I'm going to try to put more videos out. It's nearing Halloween, so actually Halloween's next week. No, but this week, there's a lot of games coming out on the 25th, so Medieval is one of the games that I want to get, so I kind of want to try to beat the original game before then. Anyways, bye, guys. Have a good night. Get some sleep. Bye-bye.